Hey everybody, Paul here with um, a new series I'm going to be starting, and it's called Chroma Squad Tactical RPG. Um, so this is a game that I picked up that was so much fun, and you know what? I really wanted to do a Let's Play of it, so let's get started with Interesting. Once upon a time, at a TV studio just like any other. Super Rangers, it is time for all stuntmen to get in the scene! Hurry up! And where are the minions? There we go! We're all set for this part! Our works will come later! Guess we're lacking some story, huh? Yeah, but Dr. Mia doesn't enjoy him that much. This is getting really boring. I'm kind of tired of... Stop talking while we're recording! Battle them, or should I remind you? That you may click to either walk or two monsters you want to attack. So, in this game, it's a tactical RPG. If you don't know what that is, you'll find out in a second. But we also get this thing called Director's Instructions where we, there's a certain criteria we could also hit, which will help us later on, and you'll see later on what they do. So for this one, we just have to defeat three enemies, which is really easy. So what you do is you, like, yeah, honestly, you have a set, like, distance you can walk with your character, and then you can click wherever you want to go, and you go right there. And it's really simple. And I'll you'll see what this does in a second. Honestly. So and then the enemies turn where they can attack you. And yeah. I won't give up. Try that again. Try that again. And so we already did what we had to do for that. So now we can just defeat the rest of them, and, uh, we'll win. <laughs> Woohoo! And so we, we completed the director's instructions. <sighs> this is one of the best episodes I've seen so far in this season. He, has, he always says that as long as we are defeating the monsters really easily. I heard you! Now we want some acrobatics. We can add some explosions to them later. What kind of? Let my finish talking! Jeez. You should use the teamwork maneuver to touch people around so they can move further. If you still don't get a word, I said. Those teamwork that click on the real sound. Oh, this is fun, actually. Okay, we're ready. So now we have to uh, feed more guys, but we're doing stuff. Ready to. So we have to perform two team acrobatics. So to do that, if you press teamwork, uh, that allows you to go further, uh, but you still have to be in like the vicinity of like them being able to th like walk to the other ones. If that makes any sense, I don't know if it does or not, but whatever. You've defeated most of them now. So now I just have to wait for that enemy. And let's just, uh, and you can also click on the different characters to 
make them attack that turn if you want. And we did those director's instructions. And they get harder and everything gets harder uh, when you get further into the story. But this is kind of like what it's like. Pe another perfect state. I'm really glad I'm here to tell you what to do all the time. Oh boy. Now start the end of the ball team up. Now down the left, the tag of media was some of those days of team up next to I trust you guys won't hurt me. So we have to perform a team attack with two squad members. So to do, in order to do that, all we have to do is do that. We have to do teamwork right next to them. And if we attack one of them, they both attack the, uh, that monster at the same time. So let's do it again. Why not? It's fun to do. Plus, you, you learn cool things from doing that later. So we did those director's instructions. Great job! Came along at the blow of death, move down for the bus can teleport out of threat. Where's that big girl in the mother show? This is how you are going to do this. Remember your training. Put four of your Jason to the monster at the table. And then attack the monster every Everyone will help you out. This is what we call the finishing bow. Why is he saying all these things again? We've done this so many times already. We just... He just likes telling people what to do, I guess. I want to know what you do to hurt the Sigma. I need the four of you to do it together. Shouldn't we fight the monster before finishing move? This feels rushed. Our audience won't enjoy it. I've never wanna hear you say, I want it that way. So we're gonna do a finishing move, which is actually really fun. So We put all the characters adjacent, we can attack and do a finishing move. Yay! We defeated the boss monster with the finishing move! You are so strong. I spread up! Now for the grand finale, I hope mother has been risen! No. This is ridiculous and not even a giant robot fight! Hark! The actors just sit in their chairs, we stuntmen do most of the recording. And besides, this is so silly! We always record in the studio! We should go outside and see different places! Come on, people! Our show is not that bad, I'm listening! Uh, where can we run our own, very own studio? Oh my, that's just perfect idea! Count me in! What? Are you ready to step over I'm in too! Let's do this! Have fun leading a studio that isn't fun to work at, Dr. Miha! Bye, 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 Dr. Miha! Oh, and please stop being so mean to your employees! You ca- Yay! <laughs> We're leaving! Oh, God. At least they are so shut the door! The stuntmen uh, met a, a moment later, still dressed in their old studio spandex suits. They talked about how they could start their own studio and record their first episode. After a few minutes, an idea popped up. My uncle has a warehouse not far from here. We sh could use it. Alright, that could be a start. It might just... It might be just what we need. 
Let's go there now! Yay! We're going to the studio! Studio! Arriving at the warehouse, everyone got very excited because of its size. And how they could take advantage of all that available space. They were looking around and thinking about camera positions. When someone spotted something. A huge pillar at the very center of the warehouse covered in some sort of dirty bedsheet. No one knew what was under it. Where are those doctors? Oh, there they are. There they are. Then they are the time I've done it on next suit. But wait, what is that? I'll just keep watching. Then curiosity, then curiosity knocked at someone's door and the sheet was removed. Amazing, an incredible replica of a device used in an American Hero TV series. Someone plugged in the energy cable and the machine said its welcome messages out loud. Hello, my name is Cerebro. This is an example message. Type the words in my back display and I shall text to speech them. Everyone's eyes shine. Wow! Let them have those clothes. I know where I want from them now. I'm just going to some dangerous blood I'm out. We were just looking for a place to set up our studio and record, but... Hey, who's that guy? Now we also have this Cerebro thing to support our story. It's amazing! Yes, yes, this is it. Just ask your uncle for this too. Our future fans will love it. Will do! I think he'll be happy to lend us anything, including the warehouse. Hooray! Everyone, gather your props at home and let's meet up tomorrow. We have plenty of work to do. So the group of friends decided to take a different path in their lives. Later that day, the clothes were returned to their old boss, and after a few weeks with the contract ready to be signed, they finally have everything ready to start recording. So, we're going to be getting a thousand dollar contract to start this off. We have to record a season finale after recording four other episodes, and the contract will be cancelled if the number of fans is lower than zero. Which, it's really hard to have that happen. So now we get to choose a studio name. Um, what do I want to call it? Let's call it... Uh... Hmm. Peterlia Company. Yeah. And now we get to choose our who we're going to have for our squad. And then we also get to choose our color, which is awesome. So let's start with assist. So we have Alert Johansson. And uh, her name is Scar. Let's so get it. Scarlett Johansson. Willa Smith. Get it? They all. Mr. Beaver, that's. Nothing, but it's still funny because he's a beaver. Mike Tyson. Uh, uh, he's a furry, this guy. Yeah. Uh, Michael Michael Florian. I don't know who he is. Uh, Michonne from Walking Dead. <laughs> a Simobot, which actually is pretty cool. Ryu Yoshi. Telemelia, don't know who that is. Uh, Wesley Stripes instead of Wesley Snipes, just an alien. Von Andy, Antitonic, and then we have J Blues. We have Jet Dude Lee, and we have Lee Mayo Mao Shin Mei. 
and May Year Up. She's wind. Uh, so I'm going to see you in a second. Uh, I'm going to choose my team. So see you in a second. Okay, so here's our team. We have Deny, the Pink Ranger. We have uh, who's the assist? We have R5D401 as the Green Ranger or Green Chromo Ran Chroma Ranger, and he's Techy. We have Claude as our Red Chroma Ranger, and he's the lead. We have Assault uh, Jet as the Assault Gray Ranger, cause that looked really cool. And then we have Lee the Scout Purple Ranger. So let's go. Uh, yeah, yeah, I want to confirm this squad. It's really cool. I have a different squad when I started. But, so, this is our little studio. We can do some, uh, of this stuff. Uh, hello, hello! How are you all doing? My name is Hermes Burrito. Burrito, probably, not Burrito. I am a master of all crafting props for movies and TV. Some of my wares even have special bonuses. Make sure to visit my shop by clicking on the bottom on the left. Have fun! So it's this one. Um, we are going to need some suits. Let's buy and equip that. Get one for you. For you. For you. For you. And let's... Do we have enough to buy everyone a sword? I don't think so. No, we only have enough to buy three people swords. That's fine. Uh, and so, in the next episode, we're going to be starting the first episode of the new Chroma Squad. I hope you guys had a fun time watching, because I had a fun time playing. And I'm really excited for this series, and I hope you guys are too. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment, share this video. It really helps me out, and I really appreciate it. Anyway, see you next time, guys. Bye.